In this illustration, we will discuss about minimum separation between two projectiles. Here, the figure shows two projectiles A and B fired simultaneously. We are equal to find the minimum distance between them during their flight. And in this situation, we can easily analyze the projectile motion of one with respect to another particle to find the minimum separation. So, here in solution, we can write here we analyze motion of projectile B with respect to A. So, here velocity of B with respect to A, if we calculate this can be given as V B minus V A. And as both particles are moving under gravity, then acceleration of B with respect to A can be taken as zero, because both are having their acceleration in y direction that is minus G. So, if the relative acceleration of B with respect to A is zero, then we can say B would be traveling in a straight line with respect to particle A. If we redraw the situation here, say if these are the two particles A and B separated by 20 meter, here B is thrown with a velocity of 20 meters per second at an angle 30 degree. As A is thrown with a velocity 20 root 3, then if we add minus V A in B, the opposite velocity vector of this at point B would be this minus V A vector and this is V B vector. So, the magnitude of this is 20 root 3 and this angle is 60 degree. So, as this is a 90 degree angle, we can calculate by parallelogram law for vector addition the velocity of B with respect to A. It is in this direction. Say if this angle is theta, the value of theta we can calculate easily as in this situation this whole angle 30 plus theta is the angle between V B A and V B. So, here we can write angle between V B vector and velocity of B with respect to A vector is this 30 degree plus theta and the tangent of this can be given as this will be V A upon V B. So, in this situation here we can write it this 20 root 3 divided by 20 that is root 3. So, this 30 degree plus theta we can write as 60 degree as 10 30 plus theta is root 3. This implies we are getting the value of theta as 30 degree. Now, in this situation if theta is 30 degree, so with respect to a b is moving along this line that is along the direction of v b a vector, then the shortest distance between a and b can be calculated by dropping a perpendicular from position of a, because we are taking a at rest, because we are analyzing the velocity of b with respect to a. So, this is the minimum distance between particles a and b during their projectile motion. So, if this point is C, we can write the minimum separation between A and B during motion is this can be written as E C and the value of E C we can write as 20 sin 30 degree that is 20 by 2 this is 10 meter and this is the final result of our problem.